Zombie Hearties, a very good morning to you, Dinky Doo, and as I say, welcome, welcome, welcome to Scotty McClue. We're live on the TikTok. Come and join us. Tremendous stuff. There we go. Excellent. Uh, now, who have we got at this time in the morning? It's uh, just gone 10 o'clock on Sunday morning, and that is uh, Sunday the 11th of July. What about that? Sunday, the 11th of July. So do come and say hi. Lovely to have you with us and a very warm welcome from around the world. Now, we had the most successful TikTok yesterday I think I've ever done. Just incredible. The numbers were huge. Today's the final. Good morning, Reverse Rob. Yes, indeed, today is the final. Then we'll all get a bit of peace and quiet and I can maybe see my soap operas again. Uh, so there we go. What do you prefer? Do you prefer soap, uh, soap operas or football? That's what we're talking about. Greetings from Durban in South Africa. Mad Mania. I don't think we've ever had anybody from Durban. How lovely to have you with us. And dinky you do. Sandy in Kent on holiday. Football's coming home. Sandy in Kent. Amazing. Welcome. Lovely to have you with us, Sandy the Scot. How's Kent looking this morning? A very fine county. Lovely to have you with us, I say. Come and join us. Thanks for joining us, Jack. Follow us as soon as you come on because we have so much to talk about and so little time to do it in. And it's wonderful to be worldwide. That's what I find absolutely incredible. One of the great things about TikTok is that we're all joined together across the world. There we are. So if TikTok are good enough to send it out to every single TikToker, then perhaps we'll start to get our numbers moving upwards. Morning from Wales. We love having you on from Wales, Lou. Yakida, I say to you. And a very, very good morning. It's Sunday, the Sabbath. Are you going to chapel? Will you be singing in a beautiful, deep, male voice tone? <laughs> That's wonderful. <laughs> Lou, fantastic. Come and join us, guys. You're watching Scotty McClue. We're live on TikTok. This is the big one. Sunday morning, of course. Nothing gets past me. Never, ever scroll past Scotty McClue because you'll miss a moment of life. If you miss a moment of life, then what is that all about? Raining the next three days, Scotty. I'm going to Canterbury today. Wow. You'll see the old Pilgrim's Road, Canterbury Cathedral, where it all began. Yes, King's School, Canterbury as well. Uh, no, I'm not going to chapel. You're not going to chapel, do to sing in a beautiful voice. Well, there we are. Tut, tut, I say to you, tut, tut. Do people still go to church these days? Um, I don't know, Scottish guy. The only problem, I would say, a lot of the churches seem to be pubs. And I think a lot of the people that used to go to church tune in to Scotty McClue live on TikTok instead. And I think that's what people do to get a real dose of spiritual guidance and help. Scotty McClue's your man. <clears throat> So there we are. I think a few people go to church. The problem is the pandemic has actually um, decimated religious worship because people can't worship together. So a lot of the masses and the divine services have been decimated by the pandemic. So there you go. However, they will all come back. I prefer to listen to you than some priest. I understand what you mean, Scottish guy. Because a lot of the priests bless them, but they don't have the life experience that Scotty McClue has. So you might actually be better listening to me, and I'll try and not make you feel too guilty. How about that for a deal? Bargain? Deal or no deal? Morning just returned to Cromarty from Iona last night. Spiritually renewed, dinky do old boy. Now, um, what I can say to you, although... Altho, I thought, Altho, yes, is fantastic. I know I own it very well. I remember George McLeod, the late Lord McLeod of Funerary, who uh, virtually rebuilt, well, he did rebuild Iona Abbey. Tremendous. Thank you, do. Good morning. Good morning, Scotty. British Army. Salute you, sir. Absolutely. Carry on. 
Uh, there we are. Do you like Anglesey? I don't like Anglesey, no. I love Anglesey. Yes, a little bit of mud down at the shore there, but very, very beautiful. Yes, I love everything really around. I've only met one very bad man in my life. He took my life savings off me in a business deal. And apart from that, I've never met a bad person. Not bad, is it? And I've done a lot of uh, a lot of things in life, met a lot of people. Um, it's coming home, says the Ramen. Lovely morning, Scotty. I have a question. Liam, ask your question of Scotty McClure. Are you going marching tomorrow? <coughs> marching tomorrow. What's uh, what's the march for tomorrow? Is it one of those? Um, is it is it a pride march? Is it the gay pride march or what is it? Do you think the U.S. should have a monarchy, Liam? What a fabulous question! What an amazing question! Yes, well, you know the U.S. would love to have a monarchy. They love Queen Elizabeth. They love uh, this country. They love Scotland, England, Ireland, and Wales, which, of course, are three monarchical countries, Northern Ireland, and, uh, and Wales, a principality, the Prince of Wales. <clears throat> now, after the American War of Independence, which you uh, commemorated last week, um, they wanted a king, but they didn't want the, the Hanoverians. So they decided to invite Bonnie Prince Charlie, Charles Edward Stuart, to be their king, the king of America. Had he accepted, it's very likely America would still have a monarch. You see? But Scotty McClue could be your next POTUS. The only problem is I'm not an American citizen. There we are. <clears throat> now, what have we got? Uh, let's see what's happening here. Uh, Donald Trump should be the U.S. monarch. Well, can I tell you, Sir Patrick, I was talking to somebody last week who said that Donald Trump is actually a king. Seriously, I'm not joking. This is not fantasy. This is not conspiracy. Donald Trump is actually a world king. Isn't that interesting? He's got that in his design. In his DNA. Wow. So there we are. So yes, I think, uh, I mean, Sleepy Joe is beginning. People are, uh, it's unraveling a bit, isn't it, after the excitement. And uh, obviously a lot of the media were, uh, you know, giving Donald a hard time for whatever reason. But uh, the man speaks the truth. He's a man of verity. So there you are. <clears throat> now, there once was a bug called COVID-19. Go on, is it a song? Donald Trump should be the U.S. monarch. Do we agree with that, guys? Tell us. Come on here. Uh, so there you are. Do you think the U.S. should have a monarchy? Answer. Yes, I think everywhere should have a monarchy because then it brings the world into some sense of uh, proportion. <laughs> and the monarchs can talk to each other. Dinky do to Bob McElroy. How lovely to have you with us from Long Island. There we are, dinky do to you on this fine Sunday morning. What do you think of that one, uh, um, you know, Bob? Do, do, do you think uh, Donald Trump should be the king of America, the monarch? Should they make him the king? What about if you have Donald Trump as the king of America and leave uh, Joe Biden as president for the next uh, three or four years? It's me, the Zimbabwean again. Michael, we love the Zimbabwean, dinky do. I also spent two days in Clangollen, North Wales. People were asking me, why don't we support England? Yes, well, it's an interesting thought that, isn't it? Do they know the history of Scotland and England? You on the brew, says Giza. No, Giza, you mustn't judge everybody by yourself. Not everybody has your lifestyle. It's just you that's on the brew at the moment. So there we go. Uh, now, it's the daft 12th tomorrow. Scottish guy, what's the daft 12th? The 12th of July. So there we are. What's that mean? Did you get your money back, Scotty? Some people can be horrid to such kind people as yourself. <coughs> no, uh, you don't get your money back when you get a hit like that. This is a person who's been doing this all his life and uh, will go on doing it to innocent people. 
So that's just the way of it. Ciao, Scotty. Ciao, Matt. Lovely to have you with us. Dinky do. Bella, bellissimo. Scotty's our TikTok granddad. There's only one king here. Thank you, Amber. I'll take that one. Uh, now, there we go. I don't think so. Maybe someone more open-minded. Liam, Donald Trump's very, very open-minded. Come on. Give us a bit of chat there. What are your pronouns? We don't need pronouns on here, Ollie. We're all inclusive. Pronouns are old-fashioned, divisive. You're trying to label people. Don't try and label people. People are people. We are human beings. There's our nouns, human beings. No pronouns. Gareth, dinky do, wonderful stuff. I will step up as king of the USA, Bob McElroy. You'd make an excellent king of the USA, based in Long Island. Do you support LGBT? Everybody does. It's LGBTs. You must include street people or you're not inclusive. It makes a mockery of the whole LGBT thing. So LGBTs, I support that. Is it coming home? 1066 is the English monarch, not British. Well, there's no British monarch because Britain is not a country. It's a landmass. So you can only have a Scottish, English, Irish or um, or Welsh, well, Wales would be the principality, but you, you, you can't have a British monarch. So there you are. We'd love to have you serve as president, Scotty. Liam, I would be honored. My fellow Americans, Scotty McClue, hashtag float us. Uh, you know, F no, sorry, put us. I am float I at the moment. Float us would be the first lady, wouldn't it? Do you support LGBT? Yeah, I've just told you all, eh? Yo! Fantastic. And uh, no, we don't like Trump. Why would you not like Trump? What's not to like? Dinky do. There's less than 20 monarchs in the world. Most nations are republic. Yeah, that's why they're failing, Scottish guy. This is the, the mistake I don't want Scotland to make. Her Majesty the Queen is the head of state and the first sovereign lady of Scotland. Uh, she would have to grant, graciously grant independence. Now, she's already graciously granted parliamentary sovereignty to the people. She could take that back at any time. So it's very important that uh, Scotland plays their cards right and make sure it never, ever, ever goes down the Republican road. All right, not after 2,347 years of monarchy. Fantastic. Scotty, I cannot see your wonderful picture. There it is. Tremendous. Lord Reith the Labrador. Way. <clears throat> Just having a sip of tea. Do you like the mug? This mug is bigger than my head. Look. See? Scotty, there we go. Hello. Hello, Laura. How lovely to have you with us. Welcome, welcome, welcome this Sunday morning to Scotty McClue live on TikTok just for you, dinky do. Mm. Now, I need every single one of you to follow me. <clears throat> I don't think we need a king, Bob McElroy. You need a king in America. Trust me, America would love a king. They'd love the pageantry. Scotty, I can't see it. There it is. There's my picture. No Trump, no Biden. We need an open-minded person in there like a moderate. Somebody like myself, Liam. Uh, we loved you in Benidorm. Thank you. Monarchs are so backwards getting wealth because their ancestors uh, were silly people. Remember your language on here? We're guests in people's house, Scottish guy. Uh, there we are. So, no, no, monarchs are amazing. All that wealth you talk about. Uh, remember, the, the, the Her Majesty the Queen gives 75% of her income to the people. How many people do that? Does the president do that? To support LGBTQ, LGBTQS. You must include streets, otherwise you are discriminating. Jesus Christ loves you. He died for you to take your sins away. Paul, you're 100% correct. I mean, he didn't need to take my sins away because I've never sinned. So there's never been a problem there. But... He did die for the sins of the world. Forza Italia. 
Italia, yes, absolutely. Hiya, Pops, hiya. Hello, my friend, how are you? We're fine, Nikki. Thank you for coming on and joining us. Uh, and now, here's DJ, DJ Quinn. Trump is quality. That's why they don't want him in power. Trump is king. So who doesn't want him in power? I'm still, thank you for your beautiful, beautiful present of TikToks to Scotty McClue. That is so kind of you. Guys, are you watching? I am still. They've just given, he's just given me, she's just given me, he has just given me 50 beautiful TikToks as a gift. Is that not gorgeous? Maria Knight spoils me on here. Lovely to have you with us, guys. Dinky do well said, Scotty. Hi, I'm back. Dinky do. Lovely to have you back. Um, I'm taking in terms of being compatible with the other parties. No, you're fabulous here. You're compatible all the time. Britain. Britain is a landmass, I see. What did you think of the last football game? I didn't see it, Hersh. I've not been watching because I'm so busy. What's the story in Balamori? Da, 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 dee, 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 dee. Now there we are. <coughs> Lovely to have you with us. Welcome Ireland and Scotland. Do you recognise Cornwall as the fifth nation? What I do, I, I tell you, Aroaray. I'll sweat like a pig this afternoon. I had chicken soup for my dinner. Up the Cornish people, I say. A good sword and a trusty hand, a merry heart and true. King James's men shall understand what Cornish lads can do. Remember that? There we go. What about that, Cornish? Uh, are you a bot because you're always live? Yeah, I know. I'm live for an hour every single day. That only leaves 23 hours. I'm not live. I must be a bot. There we are. Fantastic. Trump's the only honest politician in recent times. Scottish guy, I have to agree with you. Trump is actually speaks the truth. I've had this discussed with some very, very senior people, and they've said that, you know, there are people that don't want Donald Trump there because he makes them feel very vulnerable. You know what I'm saying? Trump is of McLeod ancestry. Yes, indeed. Is he a Lewisman? Is he a Yosach? I say, the McLeods. Fantastic. Uh, Trump, yes, absolutely. Donald Trump, fantastic. Now, if Trump hadn't been petty with anyone who disagreed with him, his presidency would have been more. Liam, I don't know that his presidency could be much more. It was pretty big. I mean, how much are you paying for a gallon of gas compared with when the Donald was in the White House? Answer me that. You know, just simple things that affect everyone's pocket in America. Who are you cheering on tonight? <clears throat> I'm cheering on the winning team. It's coming home smooth. Do you like that win, Liam? Yes, indeed. Uh, now, who else have we got? Hi, Scotty. Sarah Queen. How lovely, lovely, lovely to have you with us. There we go. Now, K-I-N, I think you're a troll and you need a lifetime ban. Guys, can you see... Kin underscore I underscore N underscore underscore K underscore I underscore N underscore. All right. Who's got zero likes and 11 followers. Okay. So what we'll do is we'll give him a lifetime ban for trolling. He obviously isn't mature enough to handle a quality stream. Say bye-bye to Kin. Bye bye, Ken. Bye. There he goes. Doing the swanny. Fantastic. That's Ken. Right, there we go. He's had it. Now, what have we got here? I'm going to bed. Bye bye, my jolly Scotsman. Tropical punch. Have a beautiful, beautiful night. Happy sleeping. Do you like whiskey? Well, I used to, Nikki, but um, I don't drink alcohol at all now. So there we are. No alcohol for my clue. What is I am still here doing? 110 TikToks. I am still. You are so generous. 
Bonnie Prince Trump, no Bonnie King Trump. Speed Bonnie boat like a bird in the wing. Fantastic. Trump was amazing. I miss the Raj, I miss the Raj. Well, you're going to miss it now, kid, because you've just done a lifetime ban for being silly. Scotty, come to America and become the king. Liam, King Scotty McClure. There we are. Um, now, who else have we got here? I'm still, what are you doing? I've crossed three borders, Scotty. Same currency, no checks. What's not to like? Sandy the Scot, dinky do. <coughs> now. Guys, is this your top TikTok live or is this your top TikTok live? Get uh, Stop scrolling. Absolutely never, ever, ever scroll past Scotty McClure. So there we are. Otherwise, you miss a moment of life. Uh, tax that was already ours. What are you on about, Scottish guy now? Scotty, Trump is loved as much as he's hated. You're splitting your audience. Bob, my audience are always together. You could never, ever, ever split Scotty McClue's audience. I'll tell you for why. If you love Scotty McClue, you will always watch or listen on the radio. If you hate Scotty McClue, you will always watch and listen on the radio. So my audience has never, ever, ever been split and never, ever, ever will be because we don't divide them, okay, and we don't rule them. The audience come here because they want to be here. Fantastic. So there you are. Trump might have split his audience. I shall bring them all together. Are you watching the football tonight? I may have a glance. A glance? Yes, indeed. What time is it on? I am still. What are you doing? I am still the most generous man on the planet. Have we seen that? He keeps sending me huge TikToks. Scotty Dinky Do, by the way. I'm going to sub Scotty on YouTube. Yes. Can every single one of you get onto Scotty McClure's YouTube channel and start subbing? Uh, guys, here's what I've got for you. There we go. Float high. Float high. Scotty McClure, first lord of the internet. Get yourselves onto that, guys. And always follow Scotty McClure. Then can you like the videos, share the videos, and get onto TikTok videos? King George the Third thought we needed a monarch. Also, no, 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 no. King George the Third had uh, had gone by that time, had he not? I'm trying to think. 1776 was he the one that was deposed with independence, and then America would have taken Bonnie Prince Charlie as king. It's coming home to Rome, says John. There we are, Mr. McClure's my birthday. Can I get a Scotty McClure happy birthday? Faye, of course you can. Happy birthday to Faye from the whole world. Fantastic. That's what it's about. We love it. Now, who have we got here? Uh, wrong, we're all sinners. No, 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 no. I'm, I'm not a sinner. I've never sinned. So come on, don't be pointing the finger. You know, absolutely. Scotty, I'm on the Italians. See, Dahlia, Dahlia. There we are. What are we getting? I am still. Uh, what are your thoughts on Prince Andrew? I don't have any thoughts on Prince Andrew. He's the son of the Queen, and that's kind of it, really. He's a man aged about, um, trying to think what Prince Andrew will be, probably around 60, the 60 mark. There you are. That's that's my thoughts on Prince Andrew. Why do you ask? There we are. Hi, Daddy Dinky Do. What do you think about the last football game? It's coming home. It's coming home. How's your morning, Scotty Dinky Do? Follow us, guys, as soon as you possibly can. Big up the Mandems. Big up the Mandems. Follow us as soon as you possibly can, everybody. Thank you. How's your morning, Scotty? Sarah Queen. My morning is outstanding because we're back with the lovely people. There was a slight drop in likes, and I wondered where everybody had gone. 
And I realized that the football, the tennis, the bowling, the darts, the table tennis, um, everything is on at the moment. And they were just watching that. <clears throat> Are you in Ayrshire? No, I'm not, Nikki. I'm not terribly far from Ayrshire. I could commute. Uh, follow us everybody as soon as you can. Thank you for my 100 TikToks there, I am. Thank you for my other 50 TikToks and my other 50 TikToks and my beautiful gifts. You are a very, very fabulous person. Thank you. It's very much appreciated. Guys, all your lovely gifts are appreciated. Follow us as soon as you can. Keep up the good lives, sorry. Enjoy them, I am. Uh, fantastic. Another more TikToks, I am. You'll bankrupt yourself, La. Keep an eye on the bank, I say. Hello, comrade. It's me from St. David. Sorry, I haven't joined in a while. Comrade, you have not. Very naughty. Morning from Thurso again, Scotty. You're always on my FY page. James, that's great news. Thank you for that. Everybody get sharing Scotty McClure on TikTok Live. Yes, indeed. These numbers should be up. Quarter of a million people used to listen every half hour on the radio. So let's get to that. How do we feel about Connor? Connor's a top man. I love Trump. I think everybody loves Trump, actually. They just don't all admit it. There we are. Uh, who's better than Trump? That's why the media hated Trump. He tells the truth. It scares them. Why can't we have mainstream media that tells the truth and just ignore all the others, just have Trumpian style media and that's it and that's what America watches why don't we just go back to one channel and have Donald Trump and Scotty McClure uh, there we are and that's your mainstream media you'll get the truth then Trump is a fantastic president read my name Buster your name is Crocodile Buster Crocodile Buster do you think Biden will last a full term I think uh, that the uh, sort of gloss is coming off that. I think people are missing the Donald. I mean, as I say, just a tiny thing like how much are you paying for a gallon of gas, a U.S. imperial gallon of gas compared with when the Donald was in. Morning from Thurso, Scotty. Thank you, do. Fantastic. Bye-bye. Bye-bye, Spicy. Have a good day. Thank you for your 200 beautiful TikToks. Doon the Swanee, Geodog. How lovely to have you with us from South Africa. Welcome, 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 I say. Tremendous. <clears throat> 50 and another 50 and another 50. So there we are. Right, crocodile, don't be spamming. Pronouns, we don't do pronouns on here. We're too modern for that. Pronouns are old-fashioned and divisive we are all inclusive so there we are fantastic right crocodile you're spamming me now i'm gonna dump you guys crocodile's leaving us monk is going doing the swanee here we are right 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 here it goes way crocodile doing the swanee what shall we do with crocodile doing the swanee Fantastic. Message from Thurzo again. You're always on my page. Trump is coming soon. We need a Campbell Potus. <laughs> Scotty, please, can we stop talking about politics? Uh, no, 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 Connor. I mean, I'm apolitical, so it doesn't matter. But uh, people like to talk about politics as well. Love the live, sir. I mean, we don't blank anything. We could talk about all sorts of things. We've even talked about football. So, you know, a few politics don't matter. Scotty, the only way to deal with the haters is to send them to the Swanee. <clears throat> I love Ireland's jokes a lot. We all love Ireland jokes a lot because we're all from Ireland. Yes, indeed. There's a good night from I am still. Top person, I am. Where are you again? Tell us again. Are you in the U.S. of A? Can you say happy birthday? Uh, to Basil, yes, I can, Mahmoud. Thank you, Mr. McClure. Have a lovely day, Fay of Three. You have a fabulous birthday. Enjoy every second of being you, because it's a wonderful thing to be. 
Fantastic stuff. Do you know the song Eloise? I do indeed, Eloise. Yes, indeed. Hello, everybody. Thank you, dear. Follow us as soon as you come on. Thank you for all you bring. I am still. I thank you for your participation, for your generosity and your kindness. Here's another very, very, very generous, kind person. Maria Knight has just joined us and is sending me TikToks. How beautiful is she? Amazing. Thank you, guys. Lovely to talk to you. I've taken up learning to play the pipes. Not easy. Geo dog. It's not easy. You've seen a picture of my father at the pipes. There we are. Have I shown you my father at the pipes? I'll see if I've got him here. There, we are. there he is. There's Big Archie at the pipes. That's my father, folks. Look at the piping fingers there. Isn't that beautiful? What a great guy he was. I loved him. I'm very, very lucky because you can't choose your parents. I just happen to have got a couple of crackers. Uh, there were, have you ever been to Elan Donan Castle? I passed it very, very late one night, and I think it was floodlit. Would I be correct? Yes, below the uh, the uh, bridge. Amphi Airshark football, nothing wrong with that. I was in Kilmarnock recently. How are you doing? Will you say something for roses? What would you like me to say for roses, chili beef? Is it polite? Is it appropriate? We're guests in people's houses. I am still sent me another hundred TikToks. Lovely, lovely, lovely person. Thank you for following us, guys. Once you're in, you're one of my top lives. Mr. Wilson, how good. Absolutely. You're mine. Thank you. My page. Uh, from uh, Florida, watch the ticket. Absolutely, I shall do. I am still, I shall be watching. You're my old music teacher. Thank you very much. Dinky do. I have to say, the radio did you well. I can't understand some Scottish people. No, very, very strange, Bob McElroy, with the highest audience in the country. And uh, it was beating all the London stations. No problem at all. There were highest audience in the country and 460,000 calls to the station in one week. <laughs> Most of them complaints, probably. There we are. Read my name. Your name is... is. No, I don't like that name, R. Kelly. I think I'll send you down the Swanee. R. Kelly's off down the Swanee, guys, for being an idiot. Dirty Midden, there he goes. Way down that Swanee. I've just clicked who you are. I knew I recognized your voice the other day. Ah, Scottish guy, dinky do. Wonderful stuff. Did you used to listen? The Mad Pfeiffer here, I can. Lovely to hear you. We have uh, Fee Fife. Fantastic. That's it. We love Fife East Weems, Ken. Garden Den. There we go. Dunfermline, Ken. Scott, support the England team. Right, Padge. I'll give them that instruction. If you're Scottish, you must support England. Padge has told us. Is that fair enough? Hey, hey says Kajal. Kajal, lovely to have you with us, Dinky Do. There we are. No. Um, sorry, can't do that. Absolutely. It's coming home. Shout out to all the Fibrosis sufferers around the world. Yes, I can, Alan. There we are. Now, Scotty, my name is Scott. Is it just ladies who tend to get fibrosis? Yes, or do other people get fibrosis? Do tell us. Bestie, what's your pronouns? We never use pronouns on here. They're divisive and old-fashioned. We are all inclusive. Nobody gets labeled. Nobody has to get judged. Okay, okay. I'm not breathing to you read my name or you can uh, hold your breath for a while longer. Uh, so there we are. Love the hat. Thank you. He talks a lot more proper than most of us Scots. Not at all. This is the way all Scots speak. That's where I learned to speak. 
Maria Dinkido Yobro, MAGA, make America great again. Yes, indeed. Hashtag MAGA. Fantastic. Bestie. There we are. Now, who have we got? He's gone. Yes, he's down the swanee. Send the TikToks. Another 94 TikToks. Maria Knight. What a beautiful, beautiful thing to do. Thank you. I thank you. Guys, you need to spread the word. Uh, guys, it's a loop. No, it's not a loop. It's live. See? Do you play? I do. I play the squeeze box and the piano. No, fantastic. I don't play the pipes. Send a shout out. I quote saying, hello, good morning. Have a fabulous day. There we go. We've done that. I like that picture. Do you like that, Bob? Is that the first time you've seen it? That's Lord Reith the Labrador, called after the gentleman that started the BBC, who was a Glaswegian. Tremendous stuff. We love that. Everyone, uh, you have a proud history. Your dad was a proud and upright man. Geodog he was. He served his country as a paratrooper for six years. From the ages of 18 to 24, he was uh, sent off to Operation Market Garden. He defended the bridge at Nijmegen. He was the radio operator doing all the communications. He would be under fire. He uh, drove the major in the jeep, uh, in the convoy. Um, he then was parachuted into Norway, and uh, he was one of the liberators. 1944, the uh, British paras dropped in with the white suits, the snow suits on, into Norway. He loved Norway and the Norwegian people. Uh, he was around at the time of the Shetland bus, uh, taking the people, the the um, high high-ranking agents out of Norway back to Scotland. He was uh, sent into Hiroshima just after the bomb had been dropped. He played the pipes on Japanese radio with his band. He then uh, came back via Australia, did guard duty in India, at the end, he was inspected by Lord Mountbatten as the last viceroy. Incredible man, uh, really. But he never, ever spoke about it, as all these people didn't, you know what I mean? Uh, Nicola wore, and uh, no, she didn't, Patch. Don't give us all that. This guy is awesome. Jose, I thank you very, very much, you top person. Dunfermline from the Iraq, Dunfermline Kent. Nay bother at all, of course, the kingdom you used of the king in Dunfermline Toon, drinking the blood the red wine. I'm a quarter Scots, that's good enough for me, Jose. You're very, very welcome. Uh, no, all people get fibrosis. Right, Alan, have you suffered? Uh, I have a good day. I just wanted to wish you a good day before I go to sleep. What a lovely thing to do, Sean. Sean, have a gorgeous sleep. Enjoy being you. You're a very smart cookie. You are a top man. There we are. Sleep well, my dear American friends and all our fellow Americans. Fantastic. 2024. Uh, there we go. 2024, you might have President McClue. That was a great story, though. Did you like that, Bob? Can you say happy birthday to my friend? I can nib. No problem at all. Hey, hey, everybody. If you've just joined us, a very warm welcome. You're watching Scotty McClue. Follow me as soon as you possibly can. What is it that people watch but don't always follow? I don't understand that. You see, I've had, as I say, about 650,000 viewers in the past seven weeks, seven or eight weeks, and I've only got 16,000 followers. I've only got 35,000 likes. So what are you guys playing at? Have you liked and followed? Have you gone on to the TikTok videos and liked them? Start start moving upwards, guys. Let's go. Uh, follow us as soon as you can. Thank you, Kathy. Wonderful. Every human being who can access TikTok should be able to watch Scotty McClue live on TikTok. This is TikTok's top talk show. What's not to like? There we are. Tap your screens. Send it round. 
Tell ten to tell ten to tell ten to tell ten about Scotty McClue. Live on TikTok just for you. Sunday. There we are. Is it coming home? We shall find out later. Is this the end of the football tonight, guys? Who knows? Are you filming this on a potato? Uh, yes, Doris, I'm filming this on one of the world's top cameras. Fantastic. So there you go. Why would you film on a potato? You'd only get as far as the skin. Unless uh, the golden wonder, you'd get a better picture, would you? Ah, uh, fantastic. Come and join us, guys, and follow us as soon as you possibly can. We're very, very busy. Never, ever, ever troll Scotty McClure. Never, ever, ever scroll past Scotty McClure. It's what we don't do. Wow. Amazing stuff. Happy Sunday, guys. I'm having a cup of tea. Woo! Right, when's the best time to go live on TikTok for you? I want some research here. Who's the guy behind you? That's me. That's Scotty McClure and Lord Reith. Let me just see milk in the tea. Oh, I've missed that. I wanted to say, somebody wanted to say hello. He's a big fan of the videos. Here we go. Uh, right, let's see what we've got here. Babyface, thank you for sharing the live video. That is immense. Love it. Follow us, guys, as soon as you come on. Uh, Nib says, please say his name. He loves your videos. Yes, indeed. I said his name, Nib. Yes, thank you for loving the videos. Milk in the tea, no milk, no milk, no, no milk in the tea. There we are, it's coming home, dinky do black tea. Takes the skin off your teeth. Man would be a better recording. Yeah, well, listen, when I've got money, if you make me TikTok famous and send me lots of gifts, I'll be able to afford better equipment, won't I? Come on, fair's fair. Remember, I lost my life savings to a very, very bad man. Yes, indeed. Maybe a lot of your viewers have been sent doing the swanee. No, Alan, nobody's doing the swanee. Only the trolls. Trolls will never learn. They'll never grow up. They'll never be mature enough to handle this because they're used to trolling other TikTok lives. They don't realize this is the big one. And we are serious. Serious business. Scotland is home. Being funny is a serious business. What's the dog's name in the picture? Chris, that's Lord Reith, R-E-I-T-H. He's called after the founder of the BBC from Glasgow, John Reith. John Charles Walsham Reith, Baron Reith of Stonehaven, Knight of the Thistle. Do you know, when John Reith was made a Knight of the Thistle, my mother went through to be with the uh, people at the Thistle Chapel in St. Giles. My mother was there. She was a great lady, I'll tell you that. And at the same time, receiving the Knight of the Thistle was Sir Charles MacLean of Duart. Chips MacLean, the Lord Chamberlain that organized Charles and Diana's wedding. How amazing was he? Yes, indeed. Follow us as soon as you possibly can, guys. Dinky do. Football's coming home. There we are. How did you lose your lifesavers? There we are. I lost them because a bad man conned me to going into a business and then disappeared my life savings into the business. There we go. And um, he was doing things like paying his own bills from the business, you know, naughty, naughty. And when I looked, thousands had gone from the bank account. So there you go. Awesome dog. Follow us, guys, as soon as you possibly can. Maria Knight has sent me sun cream. Maria, that's wonderful. Am I looking tanned? <laughs> uh, what are the shoes going with the kilt called? Uh, they're called the kilt brogues. 
kilt brogues, kilties, yes, kilt shoes very often, a pair of kilt shoes, and they are brogues with the big laces, lace up, reminiscent geodog, I would think, of the lace up leather foot thongs that the old Highlanders wore, yeah, interesting, it's all there, we're just about to start Back, Neve. Thank you very much. How fantastic is that? Lovely. Thank you very much. Nice to hear from you. Do you believe in peerages? Well, it depends if it's a life peerage or a hereditary peerage. You see, in uh, the United Kingdom, as it is at the moment, we have a house of commons full of commoners, very wealthy commoners, I hasten to add. And we have a house of lords, full of lords, very wealthy lords, I hasten to add. And the um, house of lords acts, it's worth its weight in gold, because it acts as a filter for any nonsense the commons might try to get past, you see. So uh, from that point of view, the lords are great. Now, the, the House of Lords used to be full of hereditary peers, the old aristocracy from, the, from, from Britain, from Britain as a landmass, the old aristocracy. So you're going back about 500 years, and they'd been granted lands by the king or the monarch. So you had your uh, peerages, you had the Lords Spiritual, you still do, and the Lords Temporal. The Lords Spiritual were the bishops, Yes, and the archbishops. And they're political. They're chosen by the prime minister. Uh, you know, sorry, they're chosen chosen by the queen from the prime minister. Not quite sure, but it's that level that bishops are chosen at. Uh, I'm thinking of the BBC as well. The uh, governors, what was the governors of the BBC? Um, they were chosen by the queen on the advice of the prime minister, you see? So you've got all that sort of thing. So that's your bishops, you see? So it's also very political. But what I have to say, the Labour Party, who were supposedly left-wing, but mainly central, uh, the last Labour government were mainly central, and um, slightly to the right of central, and they... Um, cut down on the House of Lords hereditary peerages. Now, that shouldn't actually have happened because what you would lose from the House of Lords was terrific big thinking experience from the aristocracy who are used to running big businesses, big estates, farmland, agrarian, yes, investments, all that sort of thing. So we lost a lot of wisdom when we got rid of these peerages. So there you are. So what I would say is, yes, I believe in peerages, but only if it's going to help other people. For instance, I have very important things to do with my time. Could I sit in London in a historic settlement, uh, in historic scenery, and could I represent my country? Very possibly, but it would take up a lot of time. You know, that's the only thing. But could I be of service to every single one of you? That's the actual question. If I couldn't be of service to every single one of you, then forget the House of Lords for Scotty McClue. Lord McClue. There we are. Fantastic stuff. First Lord of the Internet. So there we are. I'll settle for First Lord of the Internet. Hashtag float I. What kind of business was it? Well, Bob, I won't go into that too deeply. It was a media business. There we are. Fantastic. That's how he managed to catch me. Can you please say? No, I can't say that, Lacey. It sounds a little bit unkind. And we're not unkind on here, Lizzie. We're just firm. 
Well, we could be harsh, but fair. There we are, fantastic. Love the images of Scottish brigades fully decked out in the fine uniforms, very striking. Well, gee, dog, you see, they were all raised by the Highland chiefs. So you've got things like the Lovett Scouts, the Sutherland Highlanders, the 93rd, the Argyle, the Argyles. They amalgamated to become the Argyll and Sutherland Highlanders. The Queen just um, rededicated their museum in Stirling Castle last week, I think it was. So fantastic. Yes, the Argyles, I know them very, very well, shall we say. Then, of course, you've got um, the Queen's own Cameron Highlanders, my father's old regiment. You've got the Fife and Forfar Yeomanry. You've got the Scottish horse, sadly no more. The Black Watch from Perth, the Highland policeman after Culloden. You've got the King's own Scottish borderers down in the borders. You've got the Royal Scots in Edinburgh. You had the Royal Scots Fusiliers in Glasgow and the Highland Light Infantry. They are now the Royal Highland Fusiliers, and uh, they will be Scott Regiment, some number, up to about five, I think it is. There are five regiments. You've got um, the Seaforth Highlanders up in the northeast. You've got the Gordon Highlanders from Aberdeen, Bridge of Dawn Barracks, a Gordon for me. A Gordon for me. If you know a Gordon, you're no use to me. The Seaforths are bra, the Black Watch and all, but the cocky wee Gordons, the pride of them all. So the Gordon Highlanders, so you've got them. And uh, that's kind of it, I would say. I've covered most of it. Yes, I think so. Royal Scots Pontius Pilots Regiment. So there we are. Fantastic. Hiya. Hi, Angela Dinky do. Fantastic. Follow us, guys. Do you watch the 66 World Cup final? Of course. Morning, Scotty. Hashtag float high. Still two quid to go on the Southport Beach. Prices are lost rate. Well, slogan. You've been listening to Scotty McClue's YouTube videos. Yes, indeed. Guys, get on to the YouTube channel. Hello there, you beautiful, handsome, bearded lad that deserves to love, supported, and respected. Max, you are such a lovely, lovely person. Dinky-doo, I say. Oh, it's time to go. Guys, I'm going to have to dash. What well, were the only private army in the world? Of course, Alan. The Athol Highlanders, the Duke of Athol's private army. I know them well. Goodbye, everybody. Goodbye. Take care, everybody, as you go. Goodbye, everybody. Auf Wiedersehen, au revoir, and a cheerio. Tralas.